one of the first things we're going to get you to do is to try and start the RStudio program. Now, RStudio is kind of a, a shell that sits around the R software environment and makes it somewhat easier to use and we are a bit later on going to make it even easier to use by overlaying the R package R commander a point and click interface on this. Let's just have a look at this at the moment. Uh, on the left hand side we see what is called the R console so if you just start R by itself that's basically all you get um, and there are another number of other windows in uh, Studio. Um, at the moment they're, they're pretty empty we haven't started yet but we have an environment which is where the uh, the data that we read into R ends up plus any functions but we won't get into function creation in this unit um, and also on the right hand side uh, the files in our default folder and that's fairly easy to set up as well. Um, we also find that we've got some tabs and with different information here so a history of commands, package um, viewing and installation, we can talk about what our packages are um, at some other time. Any plots that we create, or plots meaning graphs and things, um, would appear in this pane here, but uh, under this tab which we can switch to, nothing in it now of course, uh, but uh, we will show you some today. Um, lots of help available in R, um, we just search for a particular topic that one just happens to be the last one that I've used uh, and I think called a viewer for different types of plotting so some maps and things that we view uh, we can interrogate Google Maps for example using R and they would appear in the viewer. Okay.